Hello, welcome to Cantonese of Gunter Radio and Television Station. Headline today. Gunter TV continues to focus on poverty building and correcting a clean and strong political system, economic development associated with society, national defense and security, commensurate with its position as the central urban of the Mekong Delta. Typical action programs in 2022-2027 help of the Central Committee of Ho Chi Minh Communist Youth Union oriented, planting 100 million new trees, supported 7,000 creative startup projects of young people, and 12 million tons of young people receiving career and job counseling. Vietnam Thailand Food and Shopping Fair will be taking place in Khun City from March 6 to March 12. Top news, Khun City continues to focus on party beauty and concreting a clean and strong political system, economic development, associated with society, national defense, and security, commensurate with its position as the central urban of the Mekong Delta. This is the request of Ms. Tung Thi Mai, the Liberal member, Secretary of the Communist Party of Vietnam Central Committee and Chairwoman of its Organization Commission at the meeting with the Standing Committee of Kanta City Party Committee on March 4. Chairwoman of Organization Commission Jun Thi Mai said that Gunther City needs an effective solution to explore inherent potential and advantages in which attention is paid to building infrastructure, traffic, and digital transformation in socio-economic development, maintaining the raw momentum, and take care of people's life. Last but not least, a need to focus on building and training high-quality human resources to meet the development requirements of the city in the future. In the process of implementing the resolution, the central government's major policy needs to summarize, evaluate it, and promptly report it and propose to solve difficulties and problems to have solutions in a timely manner. It has been 30 years since its establishment until the present. Regardless of position, the female soldiers of the armed forces of military zone 9 have always promoted their responsibilities and fulfilled their duties well. Many models of activities associated with the implementation of professional work have been effectively implemented by women's unions in the armed forces of the military zone, especially the joint work of hunger eradication and poverty elevation. These are the outstanding contents at the meeting to celebrate the 30th foreign anniversary of military women's tradition held by Military Zone 9 with the team Women of Military Zone 9 with Wisdom, Bravery, Renovation, Development. The models of BG Bank, Love Fund, Women's Union Level, Procurement Team of the Armed Forces of Military Zone have been effectively learned since 2008 in the family. The savings fund from small business and so on, with 200 cooperative groups mobilized tens of billion dollars, supporting more than thousands of members and officers to have more conditions to buy vehicles, improve family life. It house the gift was given not only motivates and empowers people to rise up, but also creates a livelihood for hunger and poverty eradication, contributing to building a strong country in terms of economy, defense, and security. Blending 100 million new trees supporting 7,000 creative startup projects of young people and 12 million tons of young people receiving career and job counseling. Those are typical action programs in the 2022-2027 term that Central Committee of Pajaman Communist Union informed that the online conference to research, study, and grab the resolution of the Trial National Congress of the Union for 2022-2027 took place on March 4 nationwide. At the Gunther location, the Youth Union of the City and other provinces, unions and delegations across the country, the conference focused on analyzing and providing information on thematic issues on the expansion of the United Front of 
gather youth and work in the field of solidarity and youth gatherings in propaganda, education, revolutionary action movements, programs to accompany the youth, the task of taking charge of the team, protection, care and education of youth and children of the Ho Chi Minh Communist Youth Union in its mission for 2022-2027. In addition, the shall set out key tasks and solutions to solve new problems, shortcomings, and limitations in youth union work and movement, actively promoting and spreading many models and good deeds for more levels of the union. The General Department of Tourism, Ministry of Culture, Sports and Tourism informed the Ministry has approved decision number 440 promulgating the Vietnam Tourism Marketing Strategy to the year 2030. The goal is that by the year 2030, Vietnam's tourism will welcome 35 million international visitors and 160 million domestic tourists more to follow. According to this strategy, Vietnam tourism continues to remove its brand with the title and logo Vietnam Timeless Jam for the international tourist market and Vietnam Endless Beauty for the domestic tourist market. At the same time, develop title, brand logo to suit for targeted markets in every stage. In addition, to focus on marketing major rubs of tourism products, including sea and islands tourism, cultural tourism, ecotourism, urban tourism, linking tourism with nighttime economic development. Finally, yet importantly, the strategy also mentions the development of new types and products of tourism, such as tourism combined with medical treatment and health care, agricultural and rural tourism, industrial tourism, sports tourism, products that set the diverse needs to tourists, such as mice tourism, educational tourism, yacht tourism, beauty tourism. Vietnam Thailand Food and Shopping Fair will be hosted in Kantar City on March 6 and takes place until the end of March 12 at Kantar Investment and Trade Promotion Exhibition Center. The fair is held on occasion of International Women's Day March 8 and is expected to have about 250 stones with a wide range of products such as Textiles, fashion, agriculture, forestry, seafood, consumer goods, jewelry, and etc. In particular, the organizers have designed the campus with many perspectives, creating impressive shapes to serve the needs of visitors to take pictures and check in. Ladies and gentlemen, climbing is a portmanteau of glamorous and camping, and is a new tourism model that is favored by young brands. The first climbing destination has appeared in Thanh Mỹ area, Thương Thanh Wall, Cái Răng Urban District, Kanta City. Now, let's go to this destination to experience the interesting, luxurious camping site in traveling around Kanta this week. About 7 kilometers from the center of Kanto City, and village looks like a peaceful village secluded from the busy downtown. This is an ideal place for young friends who love nature, like adventures, and experiential travel in a luxurious manner. The most thing I want is to provide people with experiences that are closest to nature, and village is now exploited the use of tents, the first type of tourism ever exploited in Kantor. The next thing and village is going to exploit is the music, dance, performance, and outdoor barbecue. Besides, we can buy tours on the floor to market and others. In the late afternoon, we organize visits on boats and have a sightseeing tour at dusk. Knowing about climbing tours via social networks and second their first climbing tour in the Western River region, young friends are extremely interested in their first climbing activities. We stay in tents over there. We are impressed with these tents. Usually when going on tours, we stay in hotels. It's normal. 
now we stay in tents. This brings a brand new feeling that is very close to nature. We are enjoying the afternoon tea activity exploited by Ant Village. Together with enjoying fruits and tea, we can sing songs, dance, and talk with friends. This activity is taking place on a boat like this. I like the activity of enjoying barbecue and afternoon tea and the acoustic night the most. Being a giant of Western Vietnam, we are used to the culture and life here, but the climate too is different. We don't stay overnight in hotel rooms but in tents instead and take part in activities with others. This thing is very interesting, much more interesting than other tourism types seen in Western Vietnam. Climbing is becoming a new tourist trend for young friends, and climbing in Canto brings its own experiences. Alongside camping activities, climbing in the Western Vietnam will bring you back to a peaceful life that helps you connect with nature. Coming up next, the weather forecast. Thank you so much for your attention. Please visit us on website www.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.vn.v